Hey, what's up guys? John to get into this video. I want to talk to you guys about the casino DLC and potential jobs, new businesses that we can, you know, own and stuff like that. And a couple properties that they can, you know, let us have finally after so many years. And a lot of you are going to argue that this update or so and so could not be the last um, luxury you'll see you whatever but if you look at the if you look at the um, the case you know what they're doing with the game you know they could this could have the lot la last opportunity to for it to like you know be a the only and the last or the last luxury DLC you know, and they could potentially be the best. And where where do we start off? You know, because they have fucked up all over the years. You know, they have done so many good things, and then at the same time, they changed the stuff around. They screw it. You know. So let's start off with jobs. You know. Cup three. I'm gonna give you three examples for a job, jo uh, new businesses or jobs or whatever that we can, they, that Rockstar can give us. And the first one it could be kidnapping, where we can, you know, kind of kind of kidnap people or certain rich people, you know, like politics and all that. We can be involved with the uh, with politicians, you know, we can. Have them, have them, have them, you know, kidnap their, their daughters or sons or whatever. And, like, as ransom, we can like kind of, kind of fold the law, you know, certain things we can do. And stuff like that, like, we can, I don't know, we can kind of bribe the top of politicians with it. Like, you know, if we, we want something done or so and so. Or they can, like I said, like they can use this update to tie us with the mafia, you know, since it has been leaked that we're not gonna own a um, hmm, all the casino, all the all the, the casino, and they're gonna let us players um buy certain um stocks in in the casino. What they can do is. You know, when we buy it, we eventually become a Jakuza. And if you guys don't know, that's like the Japanese version of the Mafia. We can be an organized crime. We can, like, us, 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 like, you know, us, like, you and the player and another, and the players in the lobby owning, running the casino can be call hits and stuff like that to fold. I don't know, to increase the economy. I mean, the stocks and the, in the stock market. And so, so a lot of people can invest and stuff like that. Or, and 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 this can also be, you know, ex like this uh, mafia organization deal. I mean, I don't know what you call it. Substitutional, a non substitutional organization that you know you with the other players you can, you know, vote on doing a doing a. Uh, extortion like doing extortion to someone or so like something like that or you know you can also pay like with uh, human trafficking you know where you can you and your buddies or your you know mafias like Rockstar could give us another warehouse or some corner of the of the the casino we can go around and keep kidnapping people and then sell them, you know, something like that. You know, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be sure how 100% would that work out, but ju it's just an idea, you know. And I feel like they have to price the casino at the right, at the right amount, or else people are gonna get like, you know, a lot of people are, are gonna like get mad. You know, because this and so and so. And they, I'm thinking, like, they can price the casino at maybe, I don't know, 10 to 20 million. 
on twenty on the high on the high end and ten on the low end. You know, somewhere in between or so. You know, just let me know in the comments what you think with the casino prize is going to be. You know, but I see. I really want to get to the interesting part. You know, and I saved the last, the best for last. You know, I just want to get through this quick. You know, because you know I don't want to go through big ass you know explanation. But the property I said at the beginning of this video that it can potentially add it could be the longer weighted mansions you know where they can give us the base price let's say we buy them for like a million two million and then we kinda fix them up you know we they can rockstar can make up a, a construction site or so and so where we can like decor decor the mansions from in and out and like let us have cars sh on the show floor like let's say parked on the outside of the mansion for our friends to check out and stuff like that you know but this like I'm saying this is the perfect DLC for that for Rockstar so they can add the mansions into the game because on the on the feature they're not gonna they're not gonna have a a choice and like I said the mansions can be easily priced from like 5 to 10 million to 15 million depending on the size of the mansion and they could rockstar can easily have us do like a, t a pool table they can add a pool table once in the mansion they can add like a little mini golf um on the on the back of the mansion like in the backyard they can add a bowling alley and stuff like that like what would you what would you will see in real life mansions you know something like that and let a uh, rockstar can let us design our mansion you know, there's there's a lot of there's a lot of land on this area of the map, and all this area of the map, and this area of the map, and there'd be a perfect time for Rockstar to let let us buy land and construct your own dream mansion or dream home or or whatever you know. Or they can like let us buy land and then kind of rent out, you know, another the property to I don't know some NPCs we can charge we can extortion like again that's another way they can uh, tie the extortion part of the business with the with their properties and stuff like that. But like I said, like they can literally add the mansion, the mansions of course. And add the coquette the, from the Vi from Vice City, the ninety, the, the coquette from the the Vice City, the you know the old looking eighties nineties Corvette. And they, you can also add the two thousand seven version the, from the version from from the Valley of Gay Tony and Grand Theft Auto Four and the Lost in the Dam. And they can add a whole bunch of old cars. Like they could add the, I mean they already add the Hermes, but they can add. Mm, like similar cars to the Hermes, like old school, uh, luxury, um, cars. You know, they can add, um, they can for this for this they can update for this part they can update the the Luxor Luxor Deluxe and I know Rockstar wouldn't doesn't do that, but let us have like. I don't know, a sh buy a pilot, you know, let us buy a pilot or a chauffeur, you know, because, you know, they should have done that from the beginning of those two updates, you know, but let let Rockstar, you know, let's see what Rockstar set, um, sees or wants to do with this update, you know, if they want to toss it in the garbage and make it crappy, I'm, I'm giving them plenty of ideas how, how could this be done. And let me d know down in the comments if you guys enjoy my my if you guys agree with me or disagree or whatever you guys have to say cuz you know this could easily be the coolest update and cost costly update of all times but without being said let me know that down in comments feel free to subscribe leave a like in this video if you enjoyed this video so far and you know just 
just let's let's let Rockstar know what we actually fucking want from from this game because a couple months ago they're like oh we're gonna we're gonna go what the community wants but it turns out that, that we're, we're, they're not doing what we want they're doing what they want so you know let that let them figure it out you know but like I said before let, let us know let me know down in the comments what what do you think about this ideas or so and so and you know subscribe to the channel if you're brand new to the channel welcome welcome and leave a like and share this video and I'll see you like I said I'll see you guys later and remember stay frosty